lifting our top story is the heat wave rolling over the metro area. Those triple digit temperatures are not going to be very comfortable for most people, but for a really vulnerable population, they may be nearly unbearable. We have team coverage on our extreme heat, beginning with Christine Pitawanich. She spoke with both elderly and homeless advocates, and Christine, they're doing all they can to help the people who need it. Joe, Tracy, Laurel, the Union Gospel Mission here had its first day of extended hours where people could come in off the streets, cool off a little bit. But it's not just the Union Gospel Mission making sure that vulnerable people in our area are okay in the heat. We're just doing our regular delivery of meals. It's a normal day on the job for Jody Grant. She works for Meals on Wheels an organization that brings hot meals to the elderly. And how are you faring in the heat? But with multiple days of triple digit oh heat gosh, expected awesome. at every stop yeah. with yeah. every hot meal, she asks water. questions to make sure folks are okay. Are you staying cool, drinking enough water? Oh yes. Great. Well, nice. Good, good. Holler if you need anything and we'll see you tomorrow. Staff at Meals on Wheels people say hundreds of fans have been donated in the last week or two. And just as quickly as they come in, they go back out. They are pouring in and we are distributing them to seniors all throughout Multnomah, Washington and Clark County. Giving out fans, critical for the elderly who may be unable to get out to buy a fan or might not have the money for one. I think it's just really important because a lot of people don't even get out. They may not have family nearby to check in on them. So we are the eyes and ears of some of those folks. At the Union Gospel Mission, staff are giving out bottled water left and right. Every night they team up with search and rescue, handing out water bottles, snacks and other items to the homeless who aren't in the city center. A lot of those people won't leave their camps to come to services downtown. They don't want their things stolen. They don't feel safe. So we might be their only water resource. The plan is to double the amount of water they give out. But this is all the water they have left. And now as extreme heat hits, they're asking for help, hoping people who have the means will donate bottled water. If you're interested in donating bottled water, you can drop it off here at the Union Gospel Mission at 3 Northwest 3rd Avenue in Portland. As for Meals on Wheels, staff there say they are still looking for fan donations. You can always head to their website to find out how you can donate, or you can drop off a fan at any of their 30 locations in Washington, Multnomah, and Clark counties. If you need a fan or know a senior who does need a fan, you can do all the same things. Just contact Meals on Wheels. Back to you.